Hey guys, today we're jumping into the classic 2v2 arena and we're currently sitting at 2050 MMR at 50th on the top 100 leaderboard. I'm planning on climbing back to the top 10 spot, so let's jump right in and see how the games go. At this time of night, I expect some pretty sweaty lobbies, so enjoy as we tackle the top 100 ladder. One quick announcement before we jump into the games, Among Us and Rocket League is nearly a reality and I've completed most of my portions of the map. We're expecting this to be available early December, so be sure to subscribe to keep updated with the progress. Now enjoy the video. All right, we got our first game. We got Arsenal and Mektos versus Jaro and I. It's gonna be a really tough game. We got an instant queue for this one. So it's probably a really high high level lobby everywhere everywhere around. Everyone's got a high MMR. Just to be expected. Jaro should have possession here. I'm just going to clear it over to Mechdos. Gotta wait for their touch. There we go. I'll catch this. Just space. Should flick up high. Arsenal should have a clear to the side. Jarrow's up early. Pop it around the corner. Make sure it's safe. Good pressure by Gyro. Should I get to this first? Get the clear. See if I can get the boost from him. He does steal it. Gotta start moving a little bit faster here. Get clear. I'll go for mid boost. That way, uh, Jaro can get the back corner. Wait for the touch if I can. Pop them off. Arsenal chasing it down, but Jaro should have the ball here. Good patience. I'm gonna fake this if I can. Pop over the one. Jaro's ball now. Good demo. Good fake. Could be in. Yeah, it's a good fake. I have to cover too many options there because uh, Gyro dies in a position where he's trying to catch the ball and he immediately gives it into 1v1. I got to deal with a lot of options, especially with the uh, Maxwell's on the side of ready for a pass as well off that demo. But you got to do what you got to do. Good patience. Got to do backboard here. So Gyro went full commitment into that, into that touch there or into that demo. It's a good bump and it's in. Yeah, so... Because that full commit, especially with it was off the side, there's not very many chances I'm going to score that. All right, so Jairo's chasing it down. It's going to be a bit rough here. Let's have a ball. Over me. That's a free clear. Bump Arsenal if I can. Should be a free ball. If it's in, nice. Good play. So I just went for the demo there. That's the same thing that happens in 2v2 all the time. Is that If you have a 1v1 opportunity and the other player is free, you just go for that player. I didn't get the boost there, which is really unfortunate. If he spawns on this side, it'd be even rougher for us, but... Go for the fake again. It's a very classic one, uh, 2v2 thing to do. Try to bump Maxos if I can. This boost should spawn at this, at this point. There it is. Nice pop. Nice finish, too. Don't have to do too much there. That was kind of carrying me at the end here. We're 2-2. Two two. It's a good play. Got it over one, and then the other one challenged way too early. Jaro uh, cleaning it up there. It's all right. Jaro wants it. So in that situation, you just go back, get the mid, uh, the back corner while he's getting the mid. It's a good pop towards net too. Well played. Look at Jaro go. This time he goes over. I was expecting. I was fully expecting another fake. Oh, he doesn't want to go. Just trying to fake him out because I know Arsenal's gonna have a play there if I. If I. Uh, don't go for the fake. It's okay. There's a free touch. Probably gonna fake this. Probably go for me if I can. Arsenal misses. It's okay. Silver one. So went for the boost immediately there. I should know that Arsenal's probably gonna chip that. Good play. Oh my. <laughs> okay. A little bit high of a flick there. I had space. I, I didn't. I saw that gyro respected that I was there. It's a good play. Arsenal might have a shot here. Gotta be a little careful. Should be their last. Should be an open goal here. And there we go. So 40 seconds left. Cleaned it up at the end here. The first two goals were a bit rough, but then we tied it up. Gyro doing a good job of uh, bringing back the scoreline. And so far, we've just been dealing with pressure pretty well as a team. Good play. So because Daryl's back, I'm gonna pass it back to him. It's a bit rough. Probably could have passed that a little bit better. And that'll be a finish here. I shouldn't have scored just because it's uh 
still one second left, but they ended up forfeiting anyway. So we move on to the next game. Oh boy, tough games all around. We got Daniel on my team. He's a good player. Against Gimmick in Chicago. So two RLCS players, obviously. Got time for an air dribble. Try to go behind Gimmick. You got a good pre-jump there to cover most of the options. Here I'm just going to force Chicago out if I can. Somehow he bumps me out. But Chicago is going to be pretty slow here to get back. It's a good try. I knew he was going to get re recovery there. So it's dangerous for me to go. It's a slight touch. going to keep bumping the, uh, the opponent back into our side. So that way they have to back off. As long as Daniel stays with this, it's good. If it's if he doesn't uh, hold onto it though, it's pretty dangerous. I'll wait for gimmicks touch here. Bit of a rough go though. I'll challenge here. Okay, I didn't know if he was gonna do there. Like, like maybe he was gonna stay with it or challenge. I didn't want to uh, double commit with him. So both of them. It's gonna get a bump on me. Yeah, I couldn't really get in the way of that ball because by the time he got the flip reset. Um, he already had so many options to pop it over me, so I had to wait for it. And then that final flick, it's just not very easy to defend, especially when he's going for that, that bump at the end. But both players committed on that, that, that pinch, and it could have went a lot worse for them. Daniel gets the boost too, this could be good. He's got to hold on to it though. It's a good play. It's going to be awkward for them, see if he can score. Oh, maybe not. That's fine. Good save. We both had the right idea. This shot's gonna give us some free space. Almost scared me a little bit there. Fully expected uh, that early challenge though. Should be open maybe for them, but kind of messed it up. I can get in the way. I thought he was gonna pinch it uh, down towards the net. I should have just waited though. It's not really that dangerous as long as you wait there. I feel like I could maybe block him if I could, but it went just behind me. Still leaving the comeback though. Over gimmick. Should be Daniel's ball in the corner here. It's pretty dangerous for me to go for that, but we got we gotta go. Daniel not back. It's alright, pop it around. I didn't know that Daniel wasn't back there. Good demo. It's lots of time for him to just catch that, but he wants to go for an air dribble, I guess. Nice, there we go. Almost messed that up, but I didn't realize that Daniel was going for the demo rampage. Surprised he bumped, jumped out of the way. It's two of them. Still alone for quite a while. Bumped over one. It's a good try. There we go. So we have some space. And there's the open shot. I thought Daniel was going to save it too. Just jumped in front of me. But that was a good demo from Daniel up ahead. And uh, we brought it back like I expected. Yeah, you got you to gotta stay positive to get these wins. Just since a good, good player like this. Over Chicago. He'll have it to carry, carry around. I'm watching Chicago since... Oh, here we go. <laughs> Oof. Can't really follow that. I need boost. I'm going to loop around wide. It's good. Pretty scary though. A bit of an overcommit from Daniel. I get out alive though. Make it hard for him to save it. It's a good clear. Daniel's pretty far back. I'll let him uh, try to make a challenge here if he can. Corner. Okay, he made a final touch. It was a bit spooky. Both players committed though. Let's see if he can get it forward. He's quite able to do it. Oh! Oh, you expected it. I tried to bump him into that to get a final shot. Silver one. Good dunk. I go for the pinch, which is what I fully expected. Let's 
Go for one here. That was a bit spooky. Early challenge, get a bump. Bump again. It's close. Okay, you faked it that time. Let's see if we can do a fake here. Good challenge. Yeah, make expected it. This could work out for us. Silver one. It's a good challenge. Need the boost. There's over two. Got the boost from him as well. It's a good challenge. It's pretty low here. But Daniel can hopefully stay with this. There we go. Got a good challenge. Daniel should have some space. It's a good shot. Could be just in. Nice shot. And there we go. He brought it back. So I had full faith. You just gotta you gotta hold your ground and, and make sure you stay positive. That's the way you win. If you get ever in a get in, in a negative mindset, you'll immediately start losing even harder. I've Definitely experienced that firsthand. Everyone has in Rocket League. And uh, we ended up getting a good win there against two pro players. And we're at 2081 so far. All right, we got a rematch. We got Daniel once again against Chicago and Gimmick. So they probably want their revenge. Put that high so he has to waste boost. He's definitely going to save any angle I go for. Um, so that's why I want to make sure I at least make him waste boost. It's a good shot. Chicago will have to get, make a good save. Let's come up to Daniel here. Could get a flip reset. And there we go. Nice play. Really good pass. I could tell that he was flicking that up into the ceiling. Or off the backboard there with the flip reset. Gets that finished shot. And Chicago actually makes it harder for them to get a good save. Because he pops it off to the side. But it's hard to react and make a good clear at the same time too. Do the boost. Could be a free shot here. Tried to steal it. But it was a little bit dangerous to do so. But I ended up getting his boost, which is really, really important. That's why Daniel got that free shot off the kickoff. Ball lift off to the side. Don't think it's in. Get a 50-50. Get the boost. It's a good boom. Should be in too. It's a really good clear off the side, off the backboard. Got him in the middle of a flip. Could have been a goal there because of that mid flip. I'm trying to get out of the net right now. It's a little bit difficult because I got zero boost. Holy crap. Over one. Chicago's going to get an uh, early touch. Leave it for Daniel if they can. This is okay as long as he stays with it. But he has to waste a lot of his boost just to get a touch. And it should be open. Once I see uh, Chicago make that touch, I can just come in and get a shot towards net. And we're up four goals so far. The 50 50, that's fine as well. We'll just sit with 40. Alright, now the clear should come to the right. Ooh! Wait, this could be a goal. Yeah. <laughs> when he misses that shot or hit that hit across, I already knew it was a goal. There's nothing I can do. Um, at this level, you have to really play ahead of, ahead of the game. And I have to expect that pass to come across. It's just naturally what's going to happen. Did he say take the shot? He did. And I did not pay attention. <laughs> Oops. Daniel's feeling spicy. I like it. Wow, I didn't think that was going to go through me, but I didn't get the the proper angle. So Daniel's feeling pretty spicy there. I was a little bit worried because they had, they had a free 1v1 experience or uh, opportunity there, not, not experience. Um, so I got a little bit panicky on the corner. I was trying to get the boost. I really should have just held my ground. Should be okay. Oh, there we go. Far left corner. Works out. So off that, I wanted to fake that, that challenge to make sure Gimmick throws it away with the flick. And then we come in and make that challenge afterwards. Do a bit of a fake here. He's going to probably follow it quickly, which is fine. Pop over the one. I'm just going to try to avoid the demo here if I can. It's going to be a goal though. It's going to roll enough that we get some space, but Daniel wants that boost most likely. Got some space now. We know that Gimmick's not going to challenge this. See if Daniel can pop him or beat him. Oh, nice. I'm faking this. Don't want to touch it. 
Stay with this if I can. There we go. Bump. Bump Chicago if I can. Some free space now. And there we go. They forfeit. So on that on that challenge in the corner, there's no reason for me to jump off the ceiling and, and land super far out of the play. So what I do is I just fake gimmick into a challenge and then come back off the wall and then try to collect it. I end up forcing out two 50-50s and then bump a player in the corner. So I end up keeping pretty good pressure. Let's move on to the next game. It's probably the last one. Uh, win or lose, no matter what. Uh, but yeah, it's been pretty good so far. A little bit of a slow start in these games, but now we're, we're starting to really get warmed up. Scrub killer. Interesting. All right, that was funny. We had a random running into with Scrub Killer for a second. I guess he's queuing east, but uh, the game didn't end up queuing in, as you saw. It's a fast reaction. Good save. We'll turn on this. It's not a good challenge because it leaves them space. Doesn't get the shot, though. I have possession there. I had to drift into that to make sure I stay safe. Pop him off a little bit if I can. I needed that boost, so it's a bit rough for me. It's two of them. Hopefully this mid-boost eh, won't spawn, so I gotta stay back. It's a good save. I'm gonna pop it up. I don't have much boost, so I wanna make sure I stay close here. It's a good save. Should be able to steal that boost if you can. It's a good try. Pop it over two. See if we can... Save it, he gets to the corner, which is fine. I'll stay behind Daniel if I can. Pop it off the one. Try to get the corner if I can. Daniel going here is a bit dangerous. Be a free shot for them. It's a bit of an overcommit. He's going super early for that. I gotta block him. And hopefully we can get the mid-boost. They throw it backwards. over the one. Oh no, we're in rule one here. Over one, just making sure I get in the way of gimmick. Probably gonna stay with this, I have no boost. Pretty dangerous read. Got it again. Don't want to commit yet. What? Hello game? Got the boost from him. So you can go for the double. Nice shot. So uh, I don't know what just happened with my car. <laughs> but I guess the server didn't think I got a flip off that ball. Which I definitely did because of the way I popped up. But yeah, so that was a bit weird. It was really dangerous too because we should have should have got scored on for, for it. Now watch for the, for the bump here. Probably got it again, so we got to just wait. Go for this corner if I can. Good possession. I know he's going to go, so I just want to be patient here. Let him go behind. I gotta watch for the demo, so I made sure to jump early. I want to get this boost too, so I don't get killed before uh, Gimmick comes across. Just going to play this patient if I can. Probably going to be a goal here. Yeah, that's rough. I thought I got the, the backflip in time. I, I faked that one challenge and then... Got the uh, the hit, the backflip into it. That went just past me. Got a flip here. Do okay though. Good 50 50. Let him stay with it. Probably get a flip reset or go high. Good patience. Keep it at the corner if I can. Good bump. I pinch up on this, which is fine. Chicago's in a bad spot because he's low boost. It's gonna be bad for us. Popped it over me, which is fine. Daniel should have this. I doubt they're gonna keep that up, yeah. Like, as I expected, I didn't think they were gonna keep that one up because it's pretty dangerous. This could be good for us. Good play by him. So you can stay with this. Chicago's pretty low. Don't want to challenge here. 
It's a good 50. Make sure I go for for gimmick there. It's pretty close. Pop around him. Let's make it a little bit confusing. Make it difficult for them. We'll get out. Decent. Might go for the wide wind up shot here. So be a little bit careful. Oh, no way. That's how it ends. Oh, I didn't think that Daniel was going to loop back mid I, or, or back around the corner. I think he, yeah, he turned in the corner. Oh, that's rough. I thought he was going to net, but he ended up turning around. But it's okay. That's that's fine to lose on that. Um, I think I made the right choice to challenge there because he was going back. But that turn in the corner was a bit rough. But hope you guys enjoyed that episode. It was nice to be in the top, uh, top 50, top 10 and uh, fight for a little bit more MMR. We ended up going up like about 30 to 40 points. In those games, we end up at uh, 2085. So we're almost at 2100, which is pretty good. I know I don't really do ranked videos too often, but it's pretty sweaty up in this rank. And it's that's why I usually don't do these kind of videos, because the commentary is kind of slow. I want to focus on, you know, being the best I can in the games. But until next time, guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. And we'll catch you guys in the next one.